gels are the amazing what? <laughs> Welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel. Hey girl, please subscribe down below if you aren't already. Our new subscriber goal for this channel is 1,400 subscribers by September 15th. I know we can do it. You guys are amazing and I love my bells so, so much. So anyways, for today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little different. I'm actually going to be doing a slime video. I'm going to be showing you guys how to make cream cheese slime without clay. So this is actually a really easy recipe and you don't need clay, which is awesome. All right, so basically cream cheese slime looks like this and they call it cream cheese slime because it's like the consistency of cream cheese and it's like so fun and addictive and I love it so much. The texture is like so different from like any other kind of slime like butter slime is even different from this slime so i thought you guys would enjoy this video and let me know what your guys' thoughts are by leaving me a comment down below like if you guys like this slime video if you don't um i actually did a slime video a little while ago with well a long time ago actually it's not really good quality but if you guys are interested i'll have that link down below i did like a clear slime i believe so yeah all right, with that said, let's get started with the video. Okay, so for the slime, we're gonna need a mixing bowl and spatula, food dye, which is optional, borax solution, cornstarch, white Elmer's glue or any PVA glue, um, any scent, which is optional, and shaving cream. Okay, so you're gonna wanna start off by pouring your glue into your bowl. So I added about a fourth of a cup of glue. It really just depends on how much slime you want. It doesn't really matter. Okay, so now I'm just adding in my scent, and this was a banana scent, it's just like banana extract. This is totally optional, um, but if you want your slime to feel good, I recommend adding a scent. And I added about like a teaspoon of this, it doesn't really matter how much you add. Alright, so now I am adding in my cornstarch, and you're going to want to add about four tablespoons of cornstarch to start off with. So I'm just mixing everything together and you want to be careful when you're mixing the cornstarch in because it might kind of go everywhere so you just want to slowly mix everything in. Next, I'm just adding in my food dye, and I made it kind of like a light blue color, um, which just obviously depends on what kind of shade you want your slime to be. shaving cream and you're just going to want to add about four tablespoons of shaving cream it all just like depends on how much slime you're making and everything you can't really go wrong with the amount of shaving cream you add in as you can see i'm just eyeballing it so i mean it doesn't really matter but if you want your slime to be kind of fluffy and bubbly you're going to want to add some To activate the slime, I am using borax solution, and I'll have my borax solution recipe down in the description if you guys are interested. Um, but yeah, I'm just adding about, I started off with like three teaspoons of it, but you just want to add in your um, solution very slowly because you don't want to overactivate your slime, so be very patient when you do that. Be very patient when you're stirring in um, your activator, and it should kind of like stop sticking to the bowl, if you know what I mean. And you kind of know when it starts to come together. Alright, so to finish off your slime, you're just going to want to take it out of the bowl once it stops sticking to your hands and just knead it. Um, but you guys can see I'm just kneading it and kind of getting the rest off the bowl. 
So this part is optional, but if you want your slime to have more of a cream cheese texture, I am adding about two, three-ish tablespoons of cornstarch, and I'm slowly kneading it in. Um, obviously, your slime is just going to get like a little sticky from this, but just kind of keep kneading it, and then eventually, I promise you, it'll come together. Just keep adding um, borax solution and cornstarch, and you'll have the awesome cream cheese slime. guys i really hope you enjoyed how to make cream cheese slime if you did be sure to give this video a thumbs up but yeah so that's pretty much all i have to say um if you guys want more slime videos leave them down below because i love to make slime i literally live for slime i've been making slime even before it was cool all right with that said i love you guys so much be sure to subscribe right here my little face will be right here and click my last previous video to check that one out and with that said i got a blast